All right, guys, welcome back to another reaction video. My name is James. I'm Tilbro. And today we are going to be watching um, Klaus Claus. Um, it's an animated movie. Neither of us have seen it. I'm very, very, very excited. It's Christmas yeah. animation. I've literally been saving this because you guys have been requesting this for months. I've been saving it for Christmas. It kept losing on the polls for Christmas. It finally won. Anyway, it's been a long journey to get to watching this movie. I'm very excited. Um, on the animation side of things, right? You're an animator, mm -hmm. background, all that kind of stuff. Um, so I believe, and there will be certain scenes where it's not, but like 99% of this movie is 2D. Okay. But somehow, he, I think he, this guy literally invented technology with his production company. And of course, comments correct me where I'm wrong. But he invented technology with his production company essentially to be able to have interactive lighting and um, like, like some particle effects interacting with. Because if you look at the early 2D, it just looks like a Disney movie. But then when you see the style of this movie actually looks like, it's because they have all this interactive lighting and all this craziness, stuff like that. Yeah, to me, like, that's going to be very interesting to see because I still can't really wrap my head around it. Yeah, it's insane. Like, so they had to paint the backgrounds lighting, like, to match it, but it's it's insane. Um, yeah, so, yeah, I'm that's excited. that's the coolest part about this movie. But, yeah, as always, thank you for joining us. Um, it's a little bit late, but Merry Christmas. And uh, let's just get into Klaus. As always, full-length reaction up on our Patreon. Next week's Animator Reacts, uh, this movie here. Also up on our Patreon if you want to go ahead and check that out uh, and support us. It really, really, really helps. Either way, though, thanks for joining us. Thank you for watching, and let's just get into Klaus. I'm surprised I've never even heard of this. I only heard of it when people started suggesting it. And it looks really interesting, but I haven't heard anything about the, the story or anything, so I'm just really excited. Letters. You don't really write many these days, do you? But I bet there's one. That's a cool shot. And yet, no one seems to wonder how the whole thing got started in the first place. Wait, what? Dude, this has to be 3D. Is this 2D? I don't know. Wait, hold on. It feels <laughs> it a is, little it's bit 2D. 2D, bro. No, but it's it 2D. But it looks so 3D. Look at how it moves, though. It's 2D. Oh, wait, it is 2D. <laughs> Isn't this awesome? What? It is 2D, bro. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Stop. How is he oh, a cadet? What? I've got someone covering for me. That's not what. <laughs> okay, so he's some sort of like. Is he like rich? Yeah, like rich boy. Summon to the dragon's lair. Go ahead and cancel the drill sergeant's espresso, actually. <laughs> and uh, here, why don't you finish mine? Bang. Okay, this guy's a little stuck up. Yeah. Got it. All right, let's go. Wow. Did you see that light? Yes, right? Doesn't it look great? I'll talk more about Dude, it after. Look at but... this, too. What? No croutons? <laughs> oh, man, come on. <laughs> Total oh, come on, dude. <laughs> dude. <laughs> You think I'm just going to watch you purposely fail and then let you waltz right back to a privileged life? Probably. That's probably why he's doing it. You are now a person. <laughs> that was a really cool shot. Dang. You got Whoa. one year. What? A year? Where? Smearinsburg? What is, what's happening right now? Dad! Dad! Dude, you're so too late. Um, Jasper, little Jesse, remember I said, Daddy, can I help you mail the letters? Can <laughs> that boy needs a wake up call, Sandra. Definitely, bro. <laughs> I really like this postal service. It's really, like, just this world. I really it's like it. Yeah. Dang, look at that landscape. Thanks, Dad. You're <laughs> such an idiot. The way they do the backdrops in this animation are really unique too, because they're surprisingly simple. Yeah. Yeah, you're screwed, dude. Is this England? What the heck? Maybe this isn't a Christmas movie, I don't know. Whoa. Whoa, that's so cool. It's like these ships like crashed there. That is so cool. <laughs> what what just okay. happened? <laughs> I 
These people don't have friends to send letters to. They're all dead. You just ring the bell over there, and, uh, and then the reception will start. The bell. <laughs> okay. Uh... And if you look at the ceiling, it says gullible. Okay, what is it actually going to do? Oh! oh snap. Like some sort of alarm. What the or heck? Happening! Oh, oh, what the heck? What the heck? They're just fighting? This is awesome animation, but what the heck is going on? <laughs> <laughs> the children! <laughs> Get out of here! Oh! Oh! That smoke! I like that. Uh... What's going on out here? Why is everybody just standing around? Well, look who's. Finally throwing in the towel. Throwing in the towel. Are they like split? Yeah, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> what have you got there, children? <laughs> children? They sent us another postman. <laughs> Great, dude. Don't even start with the whole. Oh, yeah. No, please. <laughs> <laughs> this is already one of my favorite animations ever. I like this place, bro. Yes, the design of the city is so cool. Well, even the idea of that, that they are fighting, kind of, and like the bell, like. Yeah. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. It's mailman. And the fairy man tricks you into ringing the bell. <laughs> the town has a battle power. The good kind. <laughs> so, I'm going to buy something to just make a chit chat. I'm mingling with our sworn enemy spot. Oh, oh no, we can't have that. So now I'm reduced <laughs> to doing this so I can get some money and start fresh somewhere far, far oh. away from here. Mail that post oh, Wait a minute, that's completely... No, hold you, loser! That was a dumb burn, okay? You're up, you're up. You're too, you're too far, you're gone. <laughs> Wow. I love this animation. Oh, oh yeah. This course. is so cool. It is really awesome. Just the the uh, the animation style, but the world, uh, even Smearsburg, but the other places, just everything about this is so unique. <laughs> oh. Um, oh. That is terrifying and really cool animation. I'm going home. No. Can't leave, remember? You'll be broke out in the streets. <laughs> yeah, it's gonna be worse. <laughs> and the people are mean to me and I miss my silk shit shop. You're gonna have to do something about you have the to uh, fix the town. Yeah, the community. Hurry ahead and get them in. She has a platform just so she can do that. <laughs> letters! Letters! I don't have all day. Oh! A freaking drive-by <laughs> with, like, harpoons? I'm a postman, see? So I can't give it to you, but I could mail it to you. Post it? Yep, <laughs> you just toss a penny over to me so I can stamp it, and we're all ready to go. I really, really would... But I can't. Oh, come on, dude. I get my letter, and you get your drawing. Win-win. You want your drawing, don't you? I if you don't, it. I'm gonna keep it. Hmm. I love it. Get my drawing back to me. Lying. Can you give him a Children penny? are liars. Oh, what? <laughs> Children <laughs> are liars. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was awesome. This animation is so cool. Does someone live there? Well, sure. Yeah, you should definitely drop by. Nice fella. That's a lie. Oh yeah, just don't ever trust the <laughs> ferryman. Whoa, that was cool. That's awesome. This is so cinematic. This is like Lord of the Rings, bro. Like, I feel like they might be grumpy. I don't think they're going to be hostile. Hello? Maybe they're trying to get away from yeah, all that, you know? Yeah, yeah. Uh, what? Um... Oh, great, dude! Ooh, ooh, ooh. Whoa! What the heck? Yo, he's actually gonna be like the nicest person yeah. ever. Oh, you're screwed! 
Oh, wait. Is it going to be like claws? Yeah, dude. Yeah, I just I just put it together. But I don't know if this is like our traditional Santa Claus. So no, I, I, it's like a different take or something on it. I mean, that's a picture of the... Uh... Wow. <laughs> that's cool. That is awesome. It's going to be the kid's Whoa. picture. <laughs> hey, Viking Santa. <laughs> <laughs> I love how bombastic the size difference between the two of them is too. Oh yeah. Like everything has like he's that massive. That cartoony, like exaggerated feel, like all the buildings. Come on, dude. Sure thing. Mm, my pleasure. Nothing I'd love to do more than deliver what I'm fairly certain can only be a <laughs> head of some kind. <laughs> Like Fortress of Doom. <laughs> Monosyllabic words. <laughs> the chimney. Oh dang! <laughs> dang! Go go go! Oh, Whoa. that was sick. <laughs> that is so cool. That's awesome. <laughs> Dang. <laughs> and so it begins. Oh, dude, that's kind of cool. This is cool. Dude, we got to get a team up together, man. Yeah. Dang. Dude, you're, These kids on, you're, are so adorable. Yosa said to bring you a penny each. It's not a letter, but don't have a postage. Oh, that was cool. Oh, snap. Let's go. It's getting kind of groovy. Let's go. Oh, that's awesome. Would you, uh, like a brand new <laughs> It looks like a drug dealer. <laughs> and bring a penny. Can't forget the penny. <laughs> this is sick. <laughs> the chalk, how are they animating? Yeah. That's crazy. Probably not an axe murderer, though. Still is a possibility, <laughs> most likely. No. That's exactly what I was thinking. Do you remember me from the nice breaking and entering last night? Just for your hands, postman. Never properly. <laughs> <laughs> so I fake prepared. You have the whole barn filled with toys just sitting there collecting dust. Why do you have a noose? Oh, good. Is it? He just put it on. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, let me think. Go away. <laughs> Mr. Klaus, sir, those little children. If you donate. Mr. Klaus, wait. This. There is some sort of like yeah mystical little element here. Yeah. Oh, I'm holding her arm. Whoa. <laughs> Tonight, same time. That was so awesome. That was awesome. Dead of night. I can just take the toys now. No, I go with. The guy who's playing Santa Claus is the same guy who plays J. Jonah Jameson and Tenzin from. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> oh, look they, at this. They're dude. from different sides, I think, right? Those kids. Oh, no. That's why she was across the fence. <laughs> oh, no. With an olive bowl. With an olive bowl. Oh, my 
how quiet he is. Yeah. And also how <laughs> other people are picking up on things like he actually is like quiet like literally when he yeah. like moves, you know? Yeah. <laughs> where did those where did the fireworks come from? It's a start, man. <laughs> okay. This, this old dude can't get a break, oh, bro. Oh, he probably wasn't You can't have cookies without milk. Yeah, they're bringing the joy this back. Is so cool. Go home, you loser. Oh yeah. Uh oh. Now, you <laughs> 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 it's like so petty. So petty. <laughs> That like boy the bounciness of the fish dude, yeah. that was really cool. There you go. Hey, well, I mean, I at least they want to learn. Like, yeah, like she learned. Wow. Can you teach me more, please? Me next. I want to write my name. Yeah, it's it's like both of them have forgotten. Like like in this crazy town, these kids are like, it's innocent. You're a kid. Yeah. You don't care. Dude, they're gonna need those, uh, the deer. Oh! <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> uh. <laughs> they don't even care, though. But they're not trying to run away from it. <laughs> that beautiful lighting. Oh, my gosh. Oh, it serves you right. Devilish little tadpoles like yourself don't get toys from class. Oh, yeah? Oh, snap. He knows. <gasps> <laughs> he keeps a list. The naughty list. <laughs> Dang, that's a cool shot. <laughs> <laughs> like, these are kids, bro. <laughs> I like this dude. Man. I do too. Dear Mr. Klaus, I traveled all the way over to my street today. We'll do this every day if you bring us <laughs> some toys. Honest, Klaus. I that is cool. Like, yeah. That's so awesome that all these kids are doing this. Yeah. She came <laughs> to our house later and she brought mom lots of berry jam. <laughs> <laughs> and then mom brought her a berry pie. <laughs> now they're trying to like one up <laughs> each other. Miss Alpha is the best teacher. <laughs> <laughs> she's like spending money on the kids too, like yeah. all of her savings. Huh. Oh snap! That's awesome. I feel like it's gonna go wrong somewhere or something though. I know, inevitably. But this is so cool. That was that was really cool. Oh, what is she gonna do? You know what to do, pumpkin. 
What the <laughs> What the heck, man? <laughs> she was like so, sort of like assassin, bro. It's like <laughs> a true selfless act always sparks another. Well, look who's suddenly a chatterbox. <laughs> Tell me, what made you squander all those words into that nugget of wisdom? I've been around long enough to know that everyone is out to get something. Those kids? Those kids are in it for the toys and the grown-ups. No, but it's not. It's not just that. What the heck? Oh no! Oh no! No! It's gonna stop it. Oh. <laughs> That's so cool. Friends of yours, I take it. Oh. Is he nice? <laughs> Yeah. You guys are not gonna believe what I <laughs> This is so I cool. Oh, it can laugh. Mr. Song. Time out, really? That's how you. <laughs> a chuckle, just a giggle. Keep it up. See what happens. All right, I'll. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you're going to run out eventually. Yeah. Looking forward to no more night shifts, right? Right. Yeah. Yeah. You know, all the kids, bro, like... We are out of toys, and without toys, there are no letters. And without letters... Ah, forget it. Can you please get off my porch? You're trespassing. Midnight brawl? Look around, Axel! Where is your clan? Oof. Where are both of your clans? What are you saying? I'm saying it's time to join forces against a common enemy. This, or it's gonna be all book clubs and cookouts and for lunches! Don't forget about the yeah. lunches! Yeah. <laughs> no. So, we must join together in peace to help stop this peace? At some point, you have to realize you're the bad guy. <laughs> Are they gonna fight? <laughs> <laughs> that animation is incredible. I don't know how they do that, but that it's is really crazy. Cool. Like all the little particles and stuff. Yeah, and this is hand drawn, man. Jasper? What, what are you? Welcome to your new works. Did his wife die? Maybe. Because remember when he said that line about the kindness? Yeah. And he was like, someone said it. I was thinking maybe that's why he's a, he's a reckless. Think of the joy. Think of the happiness. Yes, Bert, listen. I don't think. Bup, 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 bup. Let me finish. Let me finish. I don't make toys. Okay, so he stopped probably. Not anymore. You. Maybe after his wife maybe, died or something. Maybe, yeah. No. And here, chocolate with all the gears and the cogs for you to tinker with all day. Stop it. And in this corner, row after row of shiny. Dang it, man, you're pushing him too yeah. far. Class, I'm sorry. I, I, I didn't Get know. Out! Do you think. Do you think the spots were supposed to be for kids? Well, join the club. Hey, Nah, I don't want to bore you with it. <laughs> <laughs> like, just talking to this kid. I like how they don't, they don't <laughs> understand each other. Like. Now I just feel like a, I behave like a... <laughs> precisely. <laughs> hey. Is Sami like a real language or do they just make that up? It probably is. Because it, it isn't, you said? No, it pro probably is because I, I don't know if they it would... It sounds almost Dutch or something, doesn't it? This late, but by any chance would you happen to understand this? <laughs> All right, let's get started. You want some hot cocoa? Oh, snap. Dang. That's cool. Dude. A truly selfless act is met by another one. Yeah. That's awesome. That's so cool. 
Dude, I like this song a lot. Is, I just like all of this, man. <gasps> Oh, I love yeah. how bright their clothes are too. Yeah, it, like it like it seems so different than the other town, and yeah, I yeah, like yeah. that. Whoa! It's like they do that with the the surfboards. I forget what it's called. Oh no! Looks like someone might need help. Oh no! These stupid Scrooges, man. I I, I mean, how have we never defeated you? <laughs> I didn't want to admit it at first either. She used to tease me about it. She? <laughs> My Lydia. But it wasn't going to be the two of us for long. I started making toys for them. And we waited. And I kept making toys and more toys. They never came. And then... I guess I got lost. She loved birds, so I, I just kept making bird houses. Hey, you know what? We're doing it. What? <laughs> Do what? The Christmas thing. We're making all those toys. We can expand to more villages next year. Next year? And more! <laughs> I mean, your dad never said you couldn't stay. Yeah. I know, but he has to like, like he has to real, I feel like he's got to come clean. Your huh. savings? Well, not all of it. Actually, yeah, all of it. But check it out. I think it looks pretty good. What about starting far, far away from here? Oh, wow, you have no idea what you've done, do you? <laughs> oh, come on, I'll show you. Yeah, like, you've changed like... Everybody except the two grumpy mares, but besides that, it's still like centuries of like. <laughs> Look hate, at this, right? He was able to change all of that and flip it. <laughs> They're still it's still creepy. creepy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was cool. That's so cool. <laughs> they're gonna help? Wait, are they gonna help him? Yeah, they're gonna be oh, like. Oh, it's like his elves. Like elves. Yes. So is it gonna be like? We could see him. Six thousand, right? Yeah. That's what they're thinking. Oh. I, I'm worried about what they say. Like. Yeah, that's what I'm worried about too. What am I supposed to do? You gotta stay, man. Oh no. You got this great girl. You got a great town. <laughs> Hanging out with an old woodsman? I'd hang out with this old woodsman. Come on. You're never wanting anything more. What is going to happen? I have man? no idea. Whoa. <laughs> oh, hey, that's cool. Oh, yeah. Insisted, and I didn't want to be rude. And I don't know why it's a lot of red. <laughs> <laughs> Dad, what are you doing here? Time is not yet. I've still got a few days until. 14,000 letters out of Smearinsburg? Well, I had to come and see it for myself. Dad. What are they doing here? Well, they were the ones who alerted me to what you were accomplished oh. here. Good lads. A deal's a deal. The ordeal is over. Oh? No one deserves it more. Wouldn't you agree, Mr. Klaus? Oh no, did you hear that? You just duped everyone so you could get back to your puffed up life back in the big town. But people change. They. <laughs> it sucks because... I know, but he's got to prove it. Yeah. Out to get something, right? Dang it, man. Okay. Listen, he's what fallen. What are you gonna do, man? You have yeah. to do something. He's fallen. He's gotta get back up, right? 
Why are you leaving, bro? One down, one to go. Oh, great. How, what are they gonna do to Klaus? Oh, no. Finally leaving Earth with you. <laughs> like, look at, look at Smearinsburg now. Like, look yeah. at how beautiful it looks. Ever saw a postman looking more miserable leaving than on the day they came in? Come on, dude. Dude. Come on, swim something. I think I may have missed my book. <laughs> Let's go. Silk sheets. Oh, God, the silk sheets. <laughs> <laughs> Go, dude, go! Oh no, they're gonna burn yes. everything! Yes! No, dude! Well, well! Isn't this What is wrong with you horrible people? They are literally, they are literally Scrooge in a different form. Yes! They're worse than Scrooge! <laughs> and looky here, you've already got our favorite thing in the world! A nice, big pig- Oh my gosh. Oh, screw you! <laughs> Dang, that oh, animation! Whoa. Oh, whoa! What What exactly is the plan here? <laughs> oh, oh, go! That go. was clean! Why aren't they attached? I oh. thought they were attached. I would never... <laughs> <laughs> oh, what is snap. wrong with you people? You are way too dedicated to this. I know. Klaus, dude, this he just did a freaking PR karate jump onto the bag. Whoa! <laughs> oh, gosh. <gasps> no, the toys! He's gonna, Get oh it! You got it! You got it! No, I don't know. No! Stop it! Yes! See? Nothing to it. Just, I wouldn't be so Screw you! No, no, no. Yeah, they're gonna lose everything. As long as a crow or an Ellingbow have something to say about it. A true act of goodwill. Always spikes another. I think you hit your head pretty hard, dear. You should lie back down. Turn around. <laughs> Mine. <gasps> What's this? Wait! The wait! Play. What? Talking about their parents plotting to form a people <laughs> them, you know. They would destroy the decoys. Which is why he didn't want him to do it, because he was going to die for the decoys. <laughs> yes, yeah! Just what I wanted! <laughs> what did you expect? Of course she loved me. <laughs> <laughs> more children, more toys, more towns. That was cool. Holy... Huh. What is on your face? Well, you don't like it? I think it's good on me. That's so cool. I looked for him everywhere. I asked everyone, but we just couldn't find him. No goodbye. Oh. She's like a teenager. Yeah. The letters are getting in the envelope. Proceed to stamp the letter. <laughs> but I do know is that once a year, <laughs> Dude. I get to see my friend. Holy... What the heck?
Oh my gosh, bro. I'm tearing up a bit. <laughs> that was beautiful, man. That was incredible. What the heck? That was awesome, man. Wow, dude. That really hit me in the feels. That was a really good movie. Just everything. The characters. I liked the way that they did um, him and Klaus's relationship. Even the girl. Like the romance. Like everything. It was so... Like it was clear when it needed it. Like, I don't know. Sometimes kids' movies can be... Because it's a kids' movie, it's... it's. Uh, kind of in your face with some of the stuff where but this it was like the message and the idea which i think was totally beautiful was clear but then at the same time they weren't afraid to be subtle and beautiful with like some of the relationships and the character development yeah and at the same time they didn't lose um they didn't you didn't lose the character development because Mm -hmm. they were too subtle or anything like that that's crazy no yeah that was really awesome i really like that that movie like uh, really like the word to describe it for me is just beautiful it yes. was beautiful like it, in every way like it was very very beautiful this movie is criminally underrated like this is like, like number what? one on my christmas list every year now same it is it, like like that's just that's exactly what you want from a christmas movie it's beautiful okay and i don't know how you can't watch that movie and not think that's beautiful yeah, bro. Like, we gotta start trying to make this one like a classic. Yes. Like, I mean, do you want to talk about the animation? Yeah, I mean, like, I still can't really wrap my head around it. It's kind of crazy to think that like um, they created some sort of like program. I'm assuming to incorporate the lighting into like the 2D element and somehow uh, make it so that it recognizes the shapes yeah. now like i said i'm pretty sure it was just for the people which you seem yeah, to be yeah, noticing yeah. as well right so it is just for like maybe they had a special layer or something maybe that's actually how they did it yeah and that's how it recognized the shapes because of the layers or something like that but i don't know still because if you think about it let's say you think about it okay so um you have a round circle how does it know that it's round when it's flat <sighs> right how does it know that it's going like this yeah you're and at right. times like if you look at the shapes of a human like and especially it, the way they drew them in this one they yeah. were especially like uh they, they, there was like heavy like lines and curves and stuff to where the yeah. lighting really interacted but it's like even then like i can understand like okay if you got a circle you know you tell it or it recognizes that it's like a curve like that yeah but like how do you do like those really like uh you know like the human body like like the clothes and things like know. that and all the different changes like there were definitely times like i feel like like had did they have to go in there manually at times and like change it they kind must of? have because they there's must have but still it's still it's insane even doing even if they did all of it manually that's still crazy to me i'm i wish that they did more of this this is the, the really closest cool. thing to it is arcane really except arcane is totally 3d yeah it's the closest style i've what? ever seen to anything like this and that's cool see like that's that's i love seeing animations like this i love support if you've never seen this animation go on netflix right now and watch this freaking animation oh yeah i bro. like supporting stuff like this and it's it's unique it's artistic it's a beautiful story the animation is unlike any animation i've ever seen yeah this and is that like is cool like it's not lazy it's not commercial it's just like somebody had clearly had an idea for an awesome story yeah. and they were like no i don't care whether you say this is possible or not it can only look like this and this is what you get yeah that which is incredible dude that inspires me so much it's like they i mean it's it's one of those things where you got a vision and it's like you want to do everything possible to make it so that vision is, you know, as close as, you know, how you how, to how you want it, you know. And it's like they probably ran into a lot of issues and he was like, no, nah, bro, I want or whoever like directed it and everyone involved were like, no, we want it like this and we're going to do it yeah, like yeah, no yeah. matter what kind of thing, you know. And I love the like the personality that they put into like um, not just the like the movements and stuff. But just small things, like you said, like the uh, light coming behind the ear and things like that. Like, they don't have to do that. Like, But no. the fact that they do shows that they were thinking of it and they wanted to make it just that much more beautiful. Yeah. You know? And then um, 
also like the transitions like trend there were so many transitions that, that were so, so cool. clean and, yeah. and oh something else i was noticing they did reflections in the eyes oh yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. um which which made it feel really re- so like when you look at a light especially when you're drawing there'll be like a, a like a reflection mm-hmm. in your eye um and they they had that for, everywhere and so yeah, yeah, yeah. the eyes looked 3d and they looked uh because they're like your they eyes gloss. are glossy right yeah. and they all looked glossy it was incredible no yeah yeah, yeah. Like, i think yeah just the the attention to sort of um oh well, i mean of course like there are a lot of animations that that do that but uh this the is unique. attention to like detail i feel like no matter how often that it's done is always something to kind of like admire oh yeah because it shows something that like it's it's a step beyond just your job you know and yeah. this animation shows it so well I, I this is like yeah this is a really awesome animation i i hope that like in the future like they do something i really like, like the art style this. too actually oh, yeah, On a art separate style note, cool. like even if it was just straight 2d that i really like the design of the town and the feel i liked how all the characters like he really f- I don't know. They, they the way they drew the characters, it was cartoony, but it was different than I've ever seen it before. Yeah. And it really fit their characters. Even like Klaus, how big he was, but he was like very gentle giant. Like ah, just everything about it. Was so all good. the characters were so like it's like they took the time, even with the side characters, to be like, hey, there's these, you know, like they had these backstories that, you know, we we didn't really get, but we could like feel like even just having like, you know, the kind of creepy kids. Like and yeah. and then like the uh, the dude with, I don't remember the dude with the gun that like you know that like, yeah, he was breaking yeah, into yeah, in the yeah. beginning like even those people it was like, funny hey, man <laughs> dude like it's so cool like I liked all the characters man now what did you think because this is always and I don't know fully I don't have kids right so this is always a hard thing, oh, okay. but I've heard this come up a lot okay and I think it's interesting and I think this movie tackles it a little bit of like. Like, the idea behind, like, people are like, oh, you lie to your kids about Santa Claus. And, like, some people are like, that's horrible. Okay. Um, and then you see something like this, and it's like, you know, because you heard that idea, right? Where it's like, oh, they wouldn't be doing it if it wasn't for the toys. But I, I don't know. I, I think, like, what I liked about this movie, and I kind of agree with it, is I feel like there is more to it. And I feel like, you know, humans are, it's like, of course, as a kid, that's for a lot of things, right? Like, if you don't do this thing, you're going to get punished. If you, if you do this thing, you're going to get ice cream, whatever it is, right? Like... That's how humans are, especially when you're younger and you can't talk it through. But I actually think that it's really good for humans to have that sort of stuff because, I don't know, after a like, if you do something long enough, then then that becomes who you are. Even if you don't want to do, do it or you do want to do it. Like, if you work out every day, even if you hate working out every day and you're grumpy about it, you're like, I hate working out. But you work out every day, you're fit. You're a guy who works out every day. Yeah. And I think it's the same with any of this kind of stuff. Even if it starts out, you know, because you love Santa Claus and you want presents. It's like, yeah, but in the end, you know, if you're a good person for a year, it's like, th- then you're just a good, then at, at a certain point that becomes who you are. I, I don't know. Yeah. Um, I, you know, I don't want to get too in depth about course, it. Because, heck, I'm, I'm even still reeling about the animation and the story. <laughs> so it's hard and for I mean, me to think like clearly. And I mean, that's like an age old discussion. But I but wanted like, to touch on it at least. You know, I feel like there's two types of, like, um, you know, like, well, I don't know, even two types. There might be multiple types. But, like, from what I was watching, I feel like there's two types of, like, um, good, kind of. Like, they have the the good where you want something kind of in return. Mm-hmm. And to me, that's, that's still good. And obviously, there's the good where you don't want anything in return, right? So that's... So it's, like, almost imperfect pure. and then, like... Or pure, yeah. that's the way to put it. Like, one's and, a little less pure. And I feel like... Even though someone, you know, does something good and might want something in return, I don't think it it, it totally negates what they did, right? Because objectively, they're still doing good. Yeah. And, and you saw that in the town, right? Even though he wanted something in return, he, was he still, still made, changed made the a town. change, right? Because he still was doing good. Yeah. He's not not doing anything, right? He's doing something good, even though he does, like, he, he wants to get out of there. It doesn't matter, yeah. right? Yeah. And I feel like, because, I mean, if you look at it, it, does I mean, it's it's not super common that someone does something f- for nothing in return, right? Yeah. I mean, but do we say, like, all those people are bad? I mean, like, let's say, like, even firemen, right? 
yeah. the firemen go and save you, obviously they're getting paid for it. But are you going to be like, it's your job, dude? <laughs> only if you save, only if you do it because you you want to save me. Yeah, Can like, you save me. It's like no, they saved you. Yeah, it like, are you going to be like, oh, you're not. getting paid. You're you know no, you you're don't, right. aren't really doing right. something good. It's right. like, no. And then the whole thing of like lying and things like that. Like I kind of get it. I, I mean, like yeah, I guess like you're if you're lying to your kid and all of a sudden they're like, oh my gosh, you were lying to me. But it's like. You know, I feel like as a kid, but, you, I mean, if you think about like, I mean, like, you know, like animals and how they treat their young. And it's like kids aren't thinking a lot of times about these like philosophical, you know, methods or ways of doing things that they're not being like, oh, you know, I don't know, thinking like that far ahead. Right. And so mm-hmm. I feel like, you know, when we say, oh, you know, don't do this or the boogeyman is going to get you, it, it kind of like, um, you know, pushes them to do certain like, things that obviously, normally they wouldn't. You don't want to like abuse it. No, no, right? like, yeah. Of course, there's stuff where it's like, oh, you know, but but I think that to a point, and if you're saying, which I, I kind of agree with you, where you're like, look, good is good, even if there's a little bit of a selfish motive in it, or not selfish, that's the wrong way. Even if it's not as pure as complete selfless good, yeah. right? It still is good, and that's why I don't. know, I think this is cool because it's like, I, I and I kind of believe that in a broader sense, where it's like that's why I'm okay with with christmas and like like ritual whether it's religious or not just as humans we're we're physical people we like physical things and so having things that you believe in and having ritual and ideas and like hey thanksgiving is about this or whatever like christmas is about like giving and the giving spirit whatever whether like you know because some people are like oh i i'm not religious i don't celebrate christmas i'm like heck celebrate christmas anyway because there is something there and whether you you are part of a religion or not celebrating something like that having like little rituals like this is something that the east i feel like it understands intensely yeah is that these things make the quality of life better they make you a better person they make the world better yeah i mean it's just i mean it's just like a little thing like obviously if you if you hate going to parties and stuff okay it's not your thing but like you know a lot of people like like getting together. Why not get together? You know, on like New Year's or something like that. It's like even if you don't believe in you know the actual thing or whatnot, or you know you're not part of that group, it, you can still get together with people and celebrate and have fun. You know, and I think that it's you know you're missing out if you're not. Yeah. Also, um, uh, the whole uh, like tradition thing. Mm-hmm. Uh, like the whole like you know tradition of hate yeah, and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. that's another thing i kind of wanted to touch on because yeah, yeah, um, i'm about. a big person on um even when i was really young because i like the whole tradition thing because yes. i always looked at it as um something that connects us to our past yes which i was always taught you mm-hmm. know and it's like you know obviously and this is i can thank my parents for this because they did teach me well mm-hmm. and they say you know things like obviously Sometimes the traditions are kind of wacky and it's like, why do we do it? You know, mm-hmm. it's like, okay, mm-hmm. we're just doing these things to do them. But it connects us to all those people, you know, before us, right? Yeah. And if you think about it, if um, in the future someone does those things to feel connected to you, you yourself would be happy because it's like, that's how we remember them, you know? Sometimes we're not going to remember their names and things like that. They're too far away, you know? But we can remember them and honor them by following these traditions, you know? Yeah. But here, obviously, there are some times where tradition is like, especially if it's a tradition of hate. Like, it's like, okay, yeah, of well. Course, of course. Yeah, people talked about this <laughs> in the comments of the Shang-Chi thing where they were like, yeah, some people don't have ancestors that, yeah, yeah, yeah. that they want to be connected with or whatever. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? Of but, course. Sorry, I, I interrupted you a little. No, 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 go ahead, go ahead. What, what no, was no, your I just, thought? I don't know if you're thinking this, but I think I, what I like about this movie is that mm. I always get disappointed on the other end of it where people just drop tradition because there are bad traditions, right? Mm. And there are dumb traditions. But then people are like, screw tradition. And I, I don't like that. And that's why I like this movie because it's like you can make your own – like, you can create a new tradition. Like, yeah, yeah. let's say, I don't know, you come from a really bad family. But, like, guess what? You get married, you have a great husband, and you guys can start, like, your own family tradition or your own Christmas tradition or whatever it is. Like, yeah. like you can do that. And I, I think that's cool because I think tradition is not good or evil. It, it's just a thing. It's a tool. It's an idea. It's, it's part of humanity. And just like humanity, humanity is good and evil. There's some really messed up people. And, of course, messed up people can screw anything up. Yeah. But it doesn't mean tradition is bad. No, yeah. It doesn't mean, you know, rules are bad. Like, I, and I think that's cool. Yeah. I, I think tradition can also, yeah, it can be like a sort of, you know, a form of like love almost of like, 
you know, just to humanity in general, people like everywhere kind of thing, you know, it's yeah. like it connects you kind of. So, you know, and I, I, I get it. Like there are some times where like, you know, that happens also a lot with um, uh, in Japan and stuff. It's like there are some traditions that might be a little, you know, outdated or things like that. It's like, oh, OK, this is kind of hindering us from doing things. And I get it. I get it. But I feel like, um, yeah, a lot of times, like you were saying, like we go a little too far in the other direction and we say like, OK, well, you know, I'm going to completely cut myself off from everything and everyone and just be like, I'm doing whatever, which is like, OK, I mean, I guess, you know, I'm not going to tell you what to do, but it seems a little too, how should I say, I don't know, a little it's, disrespectful. It's just, it's just like, painting with a broad brush. Think, yeah. Where it's like, like we always do it. Like, for the 8 billionth time, balance. Yeah. And really, it is. Like I said, tradition is not good or bad in and of itself. Yeah. It's just a thing. And so you or whatever can decide whether it's good or bad. You know, and sometimes it's just kind of weird. And it's like, I think you should... <laughs> like, there's some weird family traditions. I don't think it's the coolest thing. Sure, it's inconvenient. But it's like, it's not bad. No, yeah. Why not? You know? <laughs> like, a lot of families have, like, you know, like little things that they do, Dude, right? yes, of course. And we all laugh about it and make fun of it. And you're like, this is the weirdest thing ever. But you do it. And, yeah, it's cool. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, thank you for joining us. Um, thank you for watching. Merry Christmas, if this is coming out right around. This is coming out day after Christmas, I guess. So, Merry Christmas, guys. Um, thank you for joining us. For any of you guys who didn't know, we're going to be doing Christmas movies, at least for our classic movies, every uh, Thursday through January. We're probably going to move on with animation, but this was such a cool animation. I was so happy Dude, with this. it was so good. Um, yeah, so as always, full-length reactions are going to be up on our Patreon. Next week's reaction, um, this animation here, is also going to be up on our Patreon if you guys want to go ahead and check that out. Um, it is pretty reasonable, and it does really help support us, helps us keep doing what we're doing. Either way, though, thank you for joining us. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you all in the next video.